Hello everyone, my name is Ilir2 and welcome back to my Let's Play of EU4 with the third Odyssey mod with Vinland. In the last episode, we had to rebuild from the absolute slaughter that was the war between us and the Elysians. And guess what happened? The Elysians declared war on us again, because fuck me, that's why. Uh, unfortunately, I guess our dreams of conquering Norway will just... Have to wait. Oh, God, the Livonian Order is taking even more of Sweden. God damn it, Livonian Order. Stop being good at the game. On the bright side, we have Denmark on our side. You know, the two-province minor of Gotland and Bornholm. Yes, very powerful. I just... Okay. So, it's over Teos, which is a fort, which is good. Although, they have all their soldiers near Teos. Oh, no, no, they're going straight for it. Yep. Well, yay. I guess, I mean, we could just fuck with North uh, New England right now, but, I mean, we can't go down there. All there's soldiers there. One army can take us down, and Muskegon, Muskegon is still four technologies under Elysia, so... <sighs> half of our army are mercenaries. We still don't, we don't even have half of our manpower. We are just... Fucked. Our leaders are meh. Let's try and find, you know, yeah, I could go into the real leader or real army. Okay. I mean, I can attack the Varangian Order. All I need to do is get a white piece again and hopefully not get absolutely annihilated this time. So let's send our soldiers down. Or at least begin to send our soldiers down. Actually, I don't want the mercenaries to go first because I am 100% sure they're already sending an army up there. So let's go to speed four. Let's see what happens here. So I don't believe they're going to be ballsy enough to attack my navy. They have 20 heavy ships. God fucking damn it. I mean, even though we're in an in, inland uh, area, inland sea... We're still not strong enough. Their navy's better than us, or their army's better than us. Spartania is idiotic, to say the least. Um, you know what? Let's abandon these colonies because I need to start saving up some money. Oh, and yeah, no, Spartania just with 6,000 over here. 6,000 soldiers. This is the military genius that is Spartania. Really. Okay, um, you guys go straight for the Varangian area. Just keep going. You go there. You go there. There. Don't let any of the mercenaries get like go on the front front line. That would just be suicide. I'm not gonna send my navy out into the main into the Atlantic right now because again, that is fucking suicide. They have already taken over Teos. They have 69,000 men in one army. Why? That is just a death stack. The supply limit's only 35 there. The AI knows it can fuck with me all at once. And I hate that. Alright, they've currently lost 4,000. They, they've lost the exact same amount from attrition than they have from battles. See this. So, 4,242 to... 7,500. Yeah. They've lost a ton of manpower just from one month. How much manpower do they have right now? 73,000. What the fuck? How? 43 of their soldiers are mercenaries. So they really only have about 100,000 real soldiers out of their 140,000. So, well, they've definitely been supplemented. I'll tell them that. Here, can we get one more mercenary army? I hope that's not going to push us over the edge. I mean, it's only... Yeah, we're making 10 out of... 10.10. .10, so we've lost... Okay, so we're down to 5.3 per month. It's not too bad. Actually, we should go to get um some war taxes. Good, we have 11 per month now. We might actually be able to get a whole new army, but I don't think I want to risk it right now. All right, you, since you're on the front line, go up there. God damn it, go, on the, go there. Go there. 
I guess at least just, just going to focus on California right now. Granted, that is where the war goal is, so I don't blame them. Um, and now we wait. They're still marching around. 72,000 men in one army marching around freaking New Mexico. Are they suicide? That's double the supply limit there. Even in their own provinces, that's double supply limit. Oh, and they take it. Or Pima, great. Gonna get there on July 1st. They've lost 15,000 due to, due to attrition. This is insane. These numbers are insane. They have a death wish. They have to have a death wish. Jesus. Alright, once we take over the Varangian area, we'll be much safer. Oh, and it looks as though... Oh, yeah, that 72,000 army is just marching through the lands. We're losing great power status? Is the tech cost difference really that much? Okay, I mean, if we lose great power status, so be it, but still. Uh, fuck it, blow it up. Use artillery to blow it up. We're at 50%. There we go. Nia Theodosia has fallen. It looks as though their entire army is over here, not focusing on me whatsoever. Well, they're focusing on me, just not my mainland. At 1% right now, but we're going to lose quite a bit of war score if Spartania can take back Teos. I will love them. They have 16 artillery and one army of 23,000. Spartania! Why? What the f- Why is it that AI is just amazing when they're against you, but when they're your ally, they're just like, what's war? I don't know what an army is. Even though, you know, you're supposed to be the freaking ancestors of Spartans. You guys don't even know how to fucking build a correct army. Hey, taking over Teos. Good. Please. Please win. And it looks as though they're sending that 71,000 over to me, which is fantastic. Yay. Oh, it fills my heart with joy to see this. Uh, okay, you can go there. You can go there. Yep, they're coming for me. And Ahok. Friggin' the Alaskans are attacking me too. Come on. Oh, and there goes that Spartanian army. Goodbye, Spartania. <sighs> yep, don't get crushed. Please don't get crushed. They got crushed. Yep, 27,000 Spartanians are dead. Yep, that's Elysia for you. <sighs> this is great. I love this game. Love this game. Uh, there's that 72,000 army. I can guarantee you. Guarantee you. That's that freaking Elise is gonna crush at least one of these armies. At least one of these armies. Come on. You gonna attack me up here or down here? If they attack me in Varia, then we have better advantage. Yep, they're attacking me in Varia. Let's wait for them to lock in. Now everyone rush over there. Dear God, this is gonna be bad. We'll all get there on like the 13th, which is two days after the battle begins. Oh my god, how do they have two point or 1.8 more morale than I do? This is... Oh my god, and they have to just... Love this game. Hey, on the bright side, we have better discipline than they do. Eight whole discipline. How did they not get a river crossing? There's a river going right down the center. You're a bullshit game. You are bullshit. Yeah, no, just all die. Yep, they're they're dead. Oh no, we won! Holy shit, we actually won. <laughs> we killed. Looks as though about twenty-five thousand. They killed a little less than twenty. Yeah, that's good. Muskegon is helping out as well out here in the back. Good job, Muskegon. What a good little buddy. 
Uh, the rest of you... Just siege up this land. What's Neo Londino? Is that London? Neo Rhodes, Neo Lemai, Agrino, Beria, all these areas in Greece that I do not know. Alright, they're sending their. It's only 51,000 now. Well, that's pretty bad. Sending the 51,000 army there. We're at negative 10 war score, which is always dandy. Uh, Spartania, what is your army at right now? Ooh. Ooh, they're down to 58. We're at 98, 40 of which are mercenaries. We have almost as many mercenaries as Elysia. But their manpower has been destroyed. They're down to 31,000. We've only lost about 6,000 manpower. They've lost like half of their manpower already. And it, yeah, they've lost a lot more overall. They've lost over 100,000 men, but they own the war goal. And it looks as though Ayak, the... Uh, Alaskan tribe is totally sieging me up, which is great. Hopefully, our little, hopefully Muskegon can help out. Okay, they are attacking me again. That's actually good. We have, I think, a better advantage this time. When are they coming in? All right, good. Everyone comes in now, even Muskegon. Thank you, Muskegon. Your help is necessary. And we're just gonna lose. We're gonna lose this battle, really? No? Okay. We almost... We're like always on the edge of losing the battle. So weird. Uh, Alright. You can go there. Make sure everyone gets off forced march. Everyone go around. Alright, cool. It's cool we lost another one. Another siege. That was a fort too. They're going straight for the capital. Yep, all of our forts down here were for nothing. Yay. War exhaustion. Oddly enough, Elysia's war exhaustion is higher than ours. Probably because they're marching around the desert with gigantic death stacks. That that would probably cause some war exhaustion. We actually have more army than they do right now. That If we can destroy that one death stack, we would be so well off. We might be able to actually turn it around. Turn this freaking um, war around. Now, where are they? Where is... Oh, God. Don't go there. Where is their army? There it is. Oh, no. They're attacking poor little Muskegon. No. I like... First of all, Muskegon, why do you have your army all the way over there? Second of all, Muskegon, why? Uh, okay. Okay. Are we going to win? It looks very close. I mean, we have lower morale, but they have we have three times as many soldiers as they do. We won, but we lost a lot more. Mostly from Muskegon, I think. If we look at the total losses, we've actually lost 53,000 soldiers. Ah, yeah, we're about 10,000 men in the hole right now. Ooh, that's not good. They've still lost about 20,000 more than we have. You know, I think we need to move up here and take out this, these, uh, these advancing armies. We want to turn off Forced March. Have you guys continue on. Good. Okay, okay, okay. We're good, we're good, we're good. We're all going to survive. It's all going to be happy, happy, fun times. None of us are going to die. No one's going to die. And they're right there with that army. If we attacked them. Let's see what they're going to do. No? Are they going to attack my little buddy? They might attack my little buddy and that'll be a bad thing. Oh, no, they ran away. Might be advancing elsewhere. Where are they going? Right, they're going there. Oh, shit. They're, they blockaded it. Let's unite these guys. All of you need to get over to there. Yes! Okay, if we can actually win this battle, that would be beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Actually, turn off Forest March. You're still going to get it there. Get them, though, right? Yes, you will. Good. Get in there. Oh my god! What is up with that morale? Whatever. 
Whatever, we're winning. Oh my god, we're actually very close to crushing that army. Holy shit. Holy shit, that's the death stack. If we can destroy that army. I mean, they've sieged up a lot of land. We're at negative 20 war score right now. But that one army, if that can get crushed... And they are moving all the way into Canada now. Great. So they're not going to get crushed. But that seems as though it's not a mercenary army. That looks as though it's a full, real army, which means it's made off of manpower. And if we can destroy their manpower reserves... When we've destroyed their manpower reserves... Yeah, they have nothing. Nope, they have 23,000 manpower left. Yep, never mind. Fuck me, I guess. Get in there. Kill them. Kill them all. I did not turn on Force March. Probably should have turned on Force March. Oh, please make it there. I mean, we're going to have a battle there. It's just not going to be a, the right battle we want. Or maybe we will. Will it? You arrive on the 10th. 12th. God damn it. Whatever. Whatever. Native settlers. Fuck you, native settlers. No. I don't care about the fucking natives deciding to do things for once. Yep. All right. We are going to lose this one. Yep. Well, it was a good try at least. It's a damned good try. Yay. And we lost way more than they did. Oh my god, Spartania! Oh no. Negative 26. I just can't fight these guys. If we took some loans and consolidated our army to stop them from having to suck out all the manpower. I mean, that death stack, that actual death stack right there is down to 7,000. That is so small. That 7,000 army is supposed to have 42,000. I could kill 42 brigades if they just arrived there at the right time. Oh, God. Damn it. Go. Just go. Just go. Muskegon, run away, Muskegon. If only there was a way you could, like, control... I mean, like, really control your little buddy's movements. Because, god damn it. This is hard. Here, so we're gonna... Where is it? Consolidate regiments. It's gonna help with my manpower. And I'm not gonna cost... It's not gonna cost as much, but consolidate... As much as possible. If we actually looked at it now, yeah, we don't have that many. How many brigades do we have? Down to 62, which is still quite a bit. And if we took out, say, two loans of 700 ducats, some mercenaries going. 20,000 mercenaries. All right, you have the correct general. Where are you running off to? Oh, near Rhodes. Nisi Rhodes, I mean. Squish the Varangian army. Renew war taxes. We didn't squish them, even though we're ten times their size. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. That's a glitch. Oh god. Oh, the graphics glitch is so bad. I don't know why that started happening, but it just did. Yep, we're down to negative 27 war score now. Still losing. We're only losing four ducats per month. That's not horrible. It's not horrible. Spartania, if Spartania leaves the war, we are totally fucked, but, I mean, actually, Spartania still has high war enthusiasm. Well, you guys have not taken any Central America. Yep, good job. And they've totally sieged up every single one of your forts. And I don't know where their army is. Where, they must be consolidating their own soldiers, I bet. I guarantee you that's what's happening. Muskegon, can you please get your soldiers over to mine? Is there no way? I, yeah, there's no way I can just... Great. Uh... Ooh, morale of armies plus 20%. Adding to them? No. 
Okay, if we tell them... No, supportive is what they're supposed to do, but they're not being supportive, they're just standing there. What are you doing? Why is my AI ally so fucking stupid? I love this game! Alright, what are they at now? So Elysia still has 119,000. I only have 78,000, most of which... Uh, 43 of which are mercenaries. I guess we also consolidated the mercenaries, which doesn't really make much sense, but whatever. Where's their armies? Ah, uh, they're all down there. Well, well, that's, no, that's bad. No, drylands, that's good. And there's no river crossing, so... Spartania might win that, especially with that 12,000 joining as well. Oh. Hey, hey, they won. Nice, and their, their leader died, and I lost... And in my God, yeah, no, I just lose thirty thousand men just in two days. Yep, that's fair. It's fair game. What? Why does the game not pause when it tells you that? Love this game. Love it. Yep, and now I basically just have mercenaries. My entire real army is destroyed. Yay. Yep, alright. Fuck this game. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. I've been Alien 2, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.